Shanghai significa en el mar, donde van y vienen las personas y los bienes. The city has developed so fast. Shanghai mirrors the changes, and there are huge changes in Shanghai from when I was a child. My name is Betty Barr. I was born in Shanghai in 1933. My father was a Scottish teacher. My mother was a Dallas, Texas YWCA worker. What means your Wang Zheng Wen? Paris in the East. El sábado sangriento de Shanghai. Los ataques aéreos japoneses cobraron la vida de más de 2,000 civiles. Our house in the Hunko district of Shanghai was bombed. Durante la ocupación japonesa, Wang Chengwen perdió a cuatro miembros de su familia. So I went to school and my teacher said to me, the war has started, go home. Las tropas japonesas detuvieron a los extranjeros que estaban en Shanghai. La familia de Betty Barr estuvo en el campo de concentración de Luanghua durante dos años. In recent years, I've been invited back to the site of my internment camp, where there is now an excellent school. And I always say to them, I hope they will work hard for peace. La liberación de Shanghai tuvo un significado importante. In May 1949, there were many, many rumors before the communist army entered Shanghai. One morning, we got up and looked out onto the road, and we saw one lone PLA soldier standing guard. The army had come in during the night, but we had not heard a thing. Uh, it was all done in a very, very orderly and quiet way. And in the morning, people found soldiers sleeping on the pavement because, of course, they were tired after marching in. George Wong and I wrote this book partly because we feel that many Westerners don't know much about China. We wanted to show there was a great change in China during our lifetimes. Betty Barr dice que Shanghai no puede separarse de sus conexiones internacionales y que el Partido Comunista de China ha hecho un excelente uso de dichas conexiones. Shanghai is my home, and I feel at home here. 